Mortal Kombat 1, it has been a minute, but I know I'm a bit late. Ermac is here. He's awesome. But most importantly, he has some of the best brutalities in the entire game. So we all know how brutalities are probably the coolest way to end a match in a Mortal Kombat game. Today, we're going to be landing every single Ermac brutality that he has, but we're going to be doing it in Combat League against the sweatiest of the sweats. Next up, I know Movado is already out. I tried him. I didn't really jive with him with Ermac at least. So we're going to stick with Janet for now. I'm thinking this team right in front of me, Sindel Movado, will be the next video. So if you want to see that, subscribe. Let me know that you want to see that. And uh, let's get on with the video landing every single Ermac Brutality. Uh, Ashra, I suck against Ashra. We're going, we're going for this one first because it's the easiest one. Okay, we have a Serena Ashra. You know what that tells me? Because Serena is the most sauceless assist in the game. So that tells me this guy's going to play very safe. Take, uh, sure, why not? Let's take what we can get here. did a teeny combo. Little baby combo, right? And then we go for overhead. All right, he does this. Uh, grab, let's go. We're doing all right. But yeah, we're going to go for the easiest one to, to get first. It's because I think that's our best shot. Oh, my God. So that's what always gets me is that that overhead is just super fast. And then she can do something right after it. Uh, we take we can get here. We think we can get here. I did the wrong button. It's okay. We actually, it's a reset. It was planned. We did this on purpose to get the reset. We did this on purpose to get the reset. I will keep telling myself that. I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, Ashra is a tough character. She's very oppressive. This one wasn't too, too insane. He didn't have any crazy, crazy combos. So I think we can get something after this. Uh, you're going to jump? Damn it. Oh, that's GG's. That's a loss. See, Ermac has the nasty issue of if you block high, there's pretty much nothing he can do. When the opponent figures that out, it's pretty much GG. Like, I see people putting this character fairly high on tier lists. I completely disagree. Okay, another character I can't stand. Fantastic. Uh, we stay away from Tanya. Okay, good, good, good. We take this. We take this. Good combo. Good combo. Nice damage here. Decent combo. We're set. Go for a low. They're never ready for the low. What did you say? How? <laughs> what? Oh. Game? Game? Ah, uh, thank you. That's fine. This stupid pull and it's stupid like That was like the worst timed lag of all time. Oh! I didn't think that would stop that. I thought I was just dead. Okay. You gonna jump? I'll raise that jump with you, stupid character. This, yeah, let's go. We got one. It's so dumb. The MK Deception reference. All right. I don't even care if we lose the set. We got our first brutality. Probably his easiest one to land. I'm not going to lie to you, but we did it against a character I can't stand fighting, so it makes me feel better. All right. Next up, we're probably going to go for maybe either the uppercut or one of the grabs. We need one of the other easy ones. Land the grabs. We just need to go. We still hold down or hold up and triangle this one's triple z is that like little z's cousin all right let's land the sickest janet cage combo i actually f my dude uh he accepted the match is he ready okay so he's got kenshi frost by the way which is like the classic top tier combo because frost can freeze me to set up for his bullshit. i have janet though just for one thing her easy combos, her combos with Ermac are like so easy to do that they're basically free. Do it again. I went right into it. Do it again. Do it again. What am I looking at here, bro? What are you doing? What are you doing? You're just trying to give me a free double. I'm not going to turn that down. But you ain't dead from this. And then uh, what do we want? We want the grab? There we go. That's a fun one. His soul leaves his body. That one is called Soul Escape. And honestly, the name checks out. I don't know what my dude was going for. I really <laughs> don't know what he was trying to accomplish. But he made it very easy for me. So I'm like, I'm not mad about it. Oh, Christmas stays. Let's go. Okay, we got a Johnny. Which means we might get an uppercut off of him. All right. All right, fine. Johnny Cyrax. Interesting, interesting, like, uh, old school combo. God, that move is so unsafe. It's gonna take me a minute because I I hate Johnny Cage in this game just because looking at him, 
He's the most boring character in the game, like, without question. But it always takes me a minute to figure out what each individual Johnny's strategy is. No way. He doesn't have these. He's, he drops these. He does drop these. Let's go! Oh my god, I have one health. Uh, Alright, what are we landing against uh, Johnny here? Uh, I don't know if we can get anything except for this. Yeah, we couldn't get it. We couldn't get it. Every other brutality he has can't be done airborne, so we don't really have a choice. But solid comeback there. Uh, I don't think it's enough. Almost, though. Now it is. Another one down, baby. Let's go. Another MK Deception reference. No, the leg is actually ruining the brutality, dude. Whatever, we got it. So we got to get this one and this one. We can do it. We can do it. Oh, uh, you know what? You know what? That's fine. It worked. It worked out. I love Sindel. I like seeing good Sindel gameplay. I don't think she's like top tier or anything, but she is good. She actually converted. The conversions. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're fine. She has no damage. What was I doing there? We can bring this back. I'm not even sure it's worth the meter investment to do it. You ain't punishing that. Your guy was so obvious. Does that hit high or low? I actually don't know. And I hope this person like can't hear my mic and doesn't realize I don't know that. I'm gonna let him do it. Oh, the flight cancels, dude. It's just not enough damage for how much effort that shit is. Let's see. Uh, this beats a projectile. It didn't beat the projectile. <laughs> uh, okay. I wanna go for separate ways, which is hold down. You can't kill for this, so I'm not even gonna bother. The corner version of this combo is ludicrous, though. That's insane. This won't work. No, 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 don't let him do it, don't let him do it. I have to go for the dub over all else. I have to, I have to secure the dub over all else. I have to. We will go for the brutal. The game's censoring itself for me. What? Hey, disconnect. Okay, that was a bona fide rage quit, actually. Come on, man. That was a pretty even game. I was having fun, leg aside. Rage quit central Mortal Kombat 11, one, whatever the hell number this is, whatever number they're up to. We're going for separate ways, which involves doing two one into a throw and then holding down. Uh, it shouldn't be hard to hit. It's just hitting a raw two one and then realizing it is hurting my brain. It's probably still we win. A sub zero. Okay, I didn't see his record. Frozone, love it. I actually gave him that. That's the one, can he do it? Does he have these? I don't have to kill. And I knew it was gonna mash. I knew it. Sub-Zero combos are so sick. He just needs a little damage buff and he'll be pretty damn good, man. When he when they buff Sub-Zero, I'll be back. Do it again. He actually just kept doing it. I gotta respect it. Okay, so here's what this guy does. Um, he loves going for the armor on Wake Up and we're gonna use that to land whatever brutality we need against him because that move is not safe, and he does it almost every time on Wake Up. And we cannot show this. Uh, show um, snowmen frolicking in the breeze or something. I don't know. Something with ice that's not violent. Non-violent ice stuff. I just didn't go for it. I literally just punished. I just punished him. This is a prime target though. We have a prime directive here. Here's what we gotta do. Just to show you one more time. I think we do, we win. It's the best one in the game. It's so good. And we got another one, boys. This one's good, but pretty gruesome, dude. Real talk, this one's pretty damn gruesome. This one might not survive demonetization, even with the green blood. We have one brutality left to land. And I'll also get the other grave if the opportunity presents itself. But Ermax brutalities are just insanity, dude. Omni-Man is an interesting choice here. I should, I should let the dialogue play. Like that. Like that perfect parry on that. I do. Oh, he's one of these guys, huh? That's so dirty. That is so dirty. I'm dead. I gave it to him for free, dude. I gave it to him for free. Okay, so that Mataro projectile is low, which is what's really throwing me off. Uh, he did it. He's doing the thing. Uh, show stock footage of trains with absolutely nothing bad happening here. Wait, no, that's the brute. That's the fatality. Um, show, um, SpongeBob and Patrick, uh, wrestling. I don't know. That's horrible. That's the worst thing, dude. 
this combination is actually pretty nasty because Mataro gives him so much coverage. I didn't, I didn't even think of this. I don't want to throw this away for the brutality, but I, I might throw it away for the brutality. No, no. The Mataro thing got me last time and then I threw it away. I threw it away for the brutality. That's horrible. Was it worth it? No, because I didn't land it. We got to get it. We got to do it. Another Ermac. Uh, it will not count if he does it against me. I'll not allow it. My, my uh, controller is stuck on something. This isn't good. Oh, don't show me the crazy sauce, please. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take a step back and then just let him throw himself in the corner. And just let him throw himself in the corner. And then we do the nice combo because it's fun. Let's go. We got the last one. Let's go. Stomp him out. Wreck. I love that one. That one used to be a brutality in MK, uh, fatality, I mean, in MK9. And I love it. I love that it's like a skill check to earn that now. We got them all, but let's close this out on a final ranked win. And maybe get that last hidden grab brutality just for fun. Because I don't know if you guys have seen it yet. It is new. Relatively new. Anyway, let's see if we can get it. What's he going to do? Teleport? I really thought he was going to teleport. That's right. They upgrade it. That move is good, but has the one really nasty issue. Uh, it takes up two bars. Like, two bars just ain't worth it. Oh, uh, you're dead. It's a full screen combo, dude. It's nuts. Oh, I never got the uppercut, did I? Did I? Actually, I don't remember. We did now! <laughs> <laughs> I had to think about it. Technically, the uppercut's on the list, not the grab. I will play one more match just in case we get the grab. Oh, Garrus is a sick character that not enough people play. I wish I could get good with Garrus. His, his gameplay, like, confuses me, but he's so f cool. See, also, another nice thing about doing this video late, we're kind of out of Ermac fever. So I'm actually getting other characters instead of just constant Ermac mirrors. Like, he's a popular character, like, no matter what, so he'll always be here, but, but day one... Or like week one, it was just nothing, nothing but Ermac mirrors. I thought we'd do more with that. Oh, dude, Garrus is sick. How can anyone tell me Garrus is not cool? I don't like this skin form. Like I like his, uh, his standard one or his like dark skin better. But Garrus is sick, dude. We got the last brutality. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, we beat the leg that was going on before and it just decided to work. Okay. But let's close this out with a dub. We'll, we'll try and hit him with another one of my favorites. Ah, uh, well, this actually... Let's go! <laughs> I wasn't planning to do the Janet one, but I figured I saw an opportunity. Why not end it on another Brutality? Guys, that is it. That is every Ermac Brutality done in a Combat League match. We had a pretty good run, too. We did some cool combos. Made some sick comebacks. This was a good video. So if you guys want to see more, like I said, I think the Sindel video will be next. And... Maybe also Shao Kahn in the near future. If you guys want to see that, subscribe for more. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments below what is your favorite brutality. And I'll see you guys next time. Till then, everybody.